Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm not out on the ocean today, but I'm actually at Miramar Lake for the very first time. This is a decent sized lake. I'm really excited to explore it. As I was going across the middle part of the lake, I noticed a depth that was 75 feet. Didn't realize how deep this lake was. It was quite surprising. Here's the first fish I caught this morning. You'll see that it's a little bluegill. They're feisty and I caught several today. I released them all. I saw marks all over my meter, so I pulled over into this part of the lake and landed another bluegill. Another little guy, so I released him as well. You'll see I'm using an inflated night crawler on a number six mosquito hook. I have to show him off to Glenn who was struggling to catch fish today. And here's some underwater footage of the release. Here I'm in a secluded cove. Great spot if you're trying to avoid the wind and I hook into yet another bluegill. I think overall I caught four today in total. These are good looking fish. Here's a better shot of one up close. So I'm gonna take him off the hook and release him and I'll show you the underwater footage again. It took a while to land the next fish, so I decided to change tactics. As I pedaled to a new part of the lake, I noticed that the fish were feeding from the surface. I saw several splashes, so I started casting a crankbait towards that area. And boy did this pay off. My crankbait was hit hard by a largemouth bass, and you could see the fight that they put up. This guy was jumping all over the place. Such a fun fish to catch. I was using four pound test, so I had to loosen the drag because I definitely didn't want to break off this fish. So I take out the lure and have to show it off to Glenn there in the background. He finally did catch a fish. It was a, uh, a bluegill. But this guy measured in at almost 17 inches. I wish I had a scale. I didn't get a chance to weigh him. This largemouth bass is a beauty. I love catching these fish. And I did release him. As promised, here was a crankbait that I used to catch the fish. It's a Rapala sinking crankbait. And it worked like a charm. Thank you. 